Y'all, I'm at the old Carnival Beach. You're gonna have to pardon me for a second while I just dip down into memory lane. So many memories and nostalgia. If you were born between, let's say, 1969 and 1979, you probably came here with your family. This 36-acre oasis of nature was the place to go whenever you were uh, young. Your parents brought you here on the weekend. It was a beach with uh, about 20 feet of white sand surrounding the lake. So what I remember the most was a huge dragon and it would spit water out. They were so ahead of their time. They had a big platform out in the middle of the lake. You'd want to you know, race your, your brothers and sisters and friends to the center of the platform and just, you know, take in the, the property. They also, on the back side, I believe, I remember a, um, like a paddle wheel boat that was on the far end. It didn't move, it stayed in place, but the wheel moved and moved water around. And that was just so cool to me. And then we can't forget the slide. I mean, again, that was the coolest, to wait in line and you'd watch everybody go down one at a time and you couldn't wait, you got butterflies in your stomach. So I talked a little bit about what it used to be, so let's go down and talk about what it could be. So it could be a lot of the same. I mean, it would be just dynamic if somebody just came and recreated those memories from the 70s. However, it would be a perfect wedding venue if some of this property was rehabbed. It could be an adventure park. It could be an RV park for the 2023 type of RV park where now you have kayaking, you can do zip lining hiking, so a little bit more of a nature trail type of RV park. And if you value privacy, you can build your own private country estate. There's so many possibilities for this beautiful property right here off of I-49 um, on what used to be called the Sunset Cairn Crow Highway. So seven-year-old me was really mostly concerned about the water activities and the adventures around the lake, but I can guarantee you the adults that came out here were mostly focused on what was happening in these buildings. Bands like TK Hewlin, Rod Bernard, Tommy McLean, they lit up this space, and that's the other draw to what was happening out here. Local music every single weekend for decades. We've talked a lot about memories. I'm standing in front of the old concession stand here now, and of course my memory here is Frito Pies, Blow Pops, Chili Cheese Dogs. But while we're talking about memories, we really want to hear your memories from Carnival Beach. So again, if you spent any time here, we would love to hear about it. As the current owners are ready to transition this property over to some new owners to revitalize and bring it back to us, we want to hear your memories. So click on the link below and let us know when you were here. If you have pictures, we want to see them. We want it all. I'm Michelle with Katie Real Estate, bringing you 36 acres of beautiful natural property in Karen Craig.